Today I'm going to create a black urban style effect. You can then save it as a preset and apply to any other photo. Hi, I'm Age from Liquid Earth. Welcome to my brand new YouTube channel. We're currently in lockdown here in the UK due to the coronavirus outbreak. So all my photography is on hold at the moment. But it's not all bad, I've got time to catch up on some photo editing and I can share some of these presets with you. So follow along and then at the end you can save a preset or you can download three free presets. All the information will be in the description. So let's start with exposure. We're going to increase the exposure by plus 26. And contrast plus 50. Highlights up 15. Shadows minus 20. And whites minus 40. Blacks minus 10. Go into the curves. So if you tap on the line, we're going to place three points. Evenly spaced. I'll start by pulling the center down. This is going to darken down our blacks and shadows. And we're going to pull the whites down slightly. That looks good. And pretty. Next, go into color. Move the vibrance up a tad to five. And the saturation down to minus 50. And then hit mix. Starting with the reds, we want saturation up 20. And luminance down minus 12. Next, the orange. Take the hue down slightly to minus 10. Saturation plus 20. And luminance minus 12 again. For the yellows, we're going to bring the hue down to minus 70. Saturation to minus 90 and luminance minus 10. For the rest of the colors, we're going to bring the saturation down to minus 90 and the luminance to minus 10. And press done. Next we'll go to Effects and we're going to add plus 20 to our texture, plus 5 to our clarity, and plus 25 to dehaze. Go into the split tone and for highlights we're going to do hue 31 and saturation 11. The shadows hue 225 and saturation 13. And press done. In the detail tab we're going to increase the sharpening to plus 60 and the masking to plus 60 also. There we go. Then we're going to add 20 to the noise reduction. And that's it, completed. Press and hold the pitch, you see the before and the after. Now that we've dialed in all the settings, let's save that as a preset. To do that, we're going to press the three dot settings, top right, and create preset. Let's name it. Let's 
cool then. Like London. You can create a preset group if you like, create new presets. Yeah, let's call this one London. That's my group folder. Press the tick. So now we can apply that to another image. So let's choose another image. To do that, we go into presets. And we'll choose our London presets and just click it and it's going to set that to black London preset with one click, press tick. And that's it, don't forget in the comments if you want to download the free DNG preset you can, I'll give you all the instructions. If you like this preset and you want to see more, like my channel, subscribe and every week I'll be delivering you more free presets. Thanks for watching, I'll see you guys next time.